Aloha and welcome to Hawaii. It's time for butt, inner thighs, and hamstrings. If you have your Oren band, uh, one of the stronger Oren bands, we're gonna place it around your ankles. All right. Now, if you don't have Oren bands, feel free to message us. Uh, we sell the packs of five for $20. All right. So we're going to have a nice wide stance and we're gonna alternate stepping back just like this. Keeping your feet nice and wide, I'm going to time us. So we'll start right here. Now, remember, if you like to listen to music while you work out, you can go ahead and put some music on in the background. Otherwise, you're gonna hear lots of chimes and chickens. Good. Stepping back. Good, feet are nice and wide. How's your day going today? Ours is going excellent. We have some nice blue skies and sunshine. Step it back. So for today's workout, we'll need your Oren bands, uh, a ball, if you have a stability ball, some weights like dumbbells or a kettlebell. Um, I am using my Fit Boots as my ankle weight. If you have an ankle weight, you can use that and something for step up. So if you have a bench or a chair, okay. stepping back. So you should already start to feel this in your butt muscles. Step it back. Oh boy. Okay. Feet nice and wide. So make sure you're not bringing your feet in we're keeping those feet out wide and just tapping out. Tap out, tap out, good. Great glute exercise. Keep going. Good, we have 60 seconds. More, keep going. Almost there, 30 seconds, you can do it. Inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth. Oh, it's burning. Five, four, three, two, last one. Ow, good work. All right, take your orange band off. We're going to be laying on our back for glute bridges. Will that ball stay there? It will. Oh my goodness. All right, so we're laying on our back. Now, if you have a dumbbell or a barbell, if you have a uh, set up for hip thrust. All right, so we're gonna lift up and squeeze your glutes. Lower, up. So really, you don't even need to touch your glutes to the mat. It's more of like a pulse, down, up, down, squeezing, excuse me, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. We're doing 50 of these glute bridges. Make sure to squeeze. We are halfway, we have 25 more. Squeeze. Last set, 15. 14. These feel great after these banded step backs, don't they? 10, 9, squeeze. You're almost there. Five more. Five, four, three, two, last one. Excellent. All right, set your weight down. Now we're going to come up. We have 30 to 45 seconds of cardio of your choice. 
So it could be jumping jacks, jump squats, jump lunges, whichever you prefer, rocket launcher. And I will time us in three, two, one. I'll do jump lunges. You could do jacks, lunges, jumps, something cardio, getting your heart rate up. 20 seconds. Come on. Jump. 10 seconds. It goes by fast. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. If you need a drink at any time, feel free to grab a drink. Next, we're going to be using your ball. So come on down, laying on our back. This exercise works our hamstrings, which are still sore from yesterday. All right, so a lot of people try this exercise and they say their ball is rolling out from everywhere. What helps is to hold on to your mat, both sides, and then dig your heels into the ball. Lifting your bum up, holding onto your mat, we're gonna roll the ball in and out. In and out, all right? Good, and we have 45 of these. Not too bad. Good. Keeping your bum up nice and high. Nice breeze. Do you have a fan on you when you work out? I like some air movement. Keep going. The wind is like natural fan. Feeling that burn? We have 15 more, 15, 14, 13. You can do it, 12. Keep your bum and your back up off the mat. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Excellent. All right, set your, your ball to the side. And we are going to be laying on your side now. And if you have an ankle weight, you can put it on your right ankle. I do not have an ankle weight, so I'm going to use my fit boot as weight. So I'm going to be laying on my side. My right leg is on the bottom, and that's the same leg you have your boot or your ankle weight on. We're going to lift up and lower, up and lower. Good, so working our inner thighs now. So we've done butt, hamstrings, and inner thighs now. Lift up and lower. Good. Keep going. Feeling it a little bit? You'll feel it more. If you don't have anything on your foot, like a, a, an ankle weight or a boot, you're not gonna feel this as much as if you do have it. So now we're going to take it up and forward. So try not to bend at the knee. Up, keep your legs straight and forward. Up, forward, good. Up and forward. Burning. Nine, keep going. Eight. Six. Five more. Five. Four. You're drawing an L with your foot. Three. Two. Last one. Good job. All right, so please go ahead. Take that boot off or your ankle weight and we're going to move to your left inner thigh now. So I'm going to put my fit boot on my left foot. We're switching sides. 
So now my left leg is on the bottom and we're going to be lifting up and lower, up and down. If you need a few more moments, go ahead and pause the video. Come back when you're ready. Good, so focusing here, mind to muscle. to that L. So you're drawing an L with your foot. It's a backwards L. Good. Up and forward. Try not to bend your knees. Up and forward. Up. Good. Should be feeling it right here. Excellent. We have 10 more, please. 10. So jump squats, jumping jacks, high knees. You ready? 30 seconds. Please begin. Ow! You can switch up your cardio each time. You don't have to do the same cardio. your breath. All right, sprinters lunge are next. So as I was mentioning, we're going to step your right leg forward and come down to your left knee. We're going to rest your chest on your thigh. And what we're going to do, if you haven't done sprinters lunge before, make sure your knee is in line with your ankle and not past your toe like that. It'd be good if you have a mirror or a window to watch your reflection. So now, we're gonna bring your left foot and tap next to your right. And then back down all the way to your knee. And up and down. Up and down, good. So we're doing 35 of these on the right leg first. And then we'll switch over to your left. Tap your knee to the mat every time and you should start to feel this here through your quads okay. we have 15 more on this side 15 We call these sprinters lunge, so if you ever see them in your workout, that's what these are. Six more. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Excellent. All right, so we're gonna switch over now to your left leg. So left leg steps forward. We're coming down to your right knee. Resting your chest on your thigh, making sure your knee is in line with your ankle and not past. So bring it here. And now we're going to bring your right foot to tap next to your left. And then please back down to your knee. Up and down. Up and down. Yes, beautiful. Remember, every rep brings you closer. 
closer to your goals, stronger, healthier, more fit. We have 25 more on this side. Feeling that burn here, 20 more. Push through the burn, challenge yourself. Touch your knee down to the mat, 10 more. 10, nine, eight, so close. Five, four, three, two, last one. Perfect. All right, grab a drink if you need it. Good. All right, time to throw in 30 seconds cardio of your choice. Three, two, begin. I'm going to do jumping jacks this time. I feel jacks in my calves a lot. strong four three two and one good now we have worked your butt and your hamstrings we're gonna come back to those inner thighs and we're going into weighted plie so you want to have your toes turned out feet are wider than hip width and you're going to sink straight down like a ballerina so it's not like that squat where you're sitting back. A plie is when you sink straight down, just like a ballerina. All right. So, we're going to do three sets of 10. Toes are turned out, like we said, wider than hip width, all the way down and up. Down and up. You could hold a kettlebell instead of dumbbells, whichever you prefer. If you're just starting out and you're a beginner, you can also do plies without weight and just focus on your form. Focus on getting nice and deep. Chickens. All the way down. Are you feeling that? Don't fall over. So we're halfway. So if you're a beginner, you can do them without weight. If you're intermediate to advanced, please pick up dumbbells or a kettlebell for 15. Remember, the more you challenge yourself, the more you see change, progress, which is what every one of us wants. Five more. Five. Four. Three. Breathe. Two. Those chimes are really twinkling today. All right, please set your weights down. And we are going into 30 seconds cardio of your choice. Are you ready? All right, here we go. Jump squats. Jump lunge, jumping jacks, high knees, mountain climbers. Big arms. 10 more, 10, nine. You can do burpees. Three, two, one, good. Now, please come down to the mat. If you have your ankle weight, go ahead and put your ankle weight on your right ankle. If you don't have an ankle weight, go ahead and put your fit boot on your right ankle. 
And we're going to come onto your hands and knees. We have 25 kneeling kickback each side. Alright, ready? Good. Squeeze up nice and high. take your ankle weight or your fit boot off. We're going into your left leg. Hear those birds? All right, same thing. So we're going to come back onto your hands and knees. You don't have to worry about doing your buckles up. Back onto your hands and knees and now we're going to kick back left leg. Now you can do this from your hands or you can come down to your elbows, whichever you prefer. Squeeze your glutes. Doing good. Dog fight. Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Five, four, three, two, last one. There it is. All right. Please sit down. You can take your fit boot off or your ankle weight. Good job. And we're going to come in to, uh, you can put your running shoes back on. If you had taken them off, you can put them back on. Pause the video if you need a few more seconds. Alright, cardio of your choice. I'm going to do jump lunge again for 30 seconds. Then we're going to go into our deadlifts. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, begin. I found this on the web. <sighs> Every time. Ten more. Jump, jump, jump. Four, three, two, one. Whew. Catch your breath. Next, we are going into deadlifts. We have 20 of them. You can use barbell, dumbbells, kettlebell. All right, so grab your weights. The most important part here is to keep your back straight. Feet are about hip width or just a little wider apart. Keep your weights nice and close to your shins as you hinge at the hip down and up. So with deadlifts, we want to feel this through our hamstring, our bum, and lower back. Just a slight bend in your knee. And up. You can squeeze your glutes at the top if you like. Squeeze. And down. Excellent. We have 10 more. Are you reading any good books right now? I am re reading a really great one called, I think it's called The Emotion Advantage. I'll double check that. By Randy Taran. It is so good. Two, 
One more. All right, good. Please set these down. Cardio of your choice. Um, I'm going to do jump lunge again. 30 seconds on the clock and we can begin. Jumping jacks, burpees, jump squats. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Single, thank you chicken. Coming down to the mat for single leg glute bridge. Now, part of the reason I love single leg glute bridge is they're challenging, um, but they really get the butt and inner thigh and hamstring. So all those muscle groups that we're working today. So we're gonna work our left butt cheek first, which means we're going to take your right foot either straight up to the sky or place the heel on your left knee. Now we're going to lift, hi bird, lifting your bum up off the mat. Now it's helpful if your foot is a little bit closer to your bum. If it's farther out, you're not gonna get as high, but see how you're, see how you're comfortable. All right, so we have three sets of 10 on your left leg and then we're gonna switch over to your right. Ready? Press it up and lower. Up and lower. Up. Making sure to squeeze your left butt cheek. Squeeze. 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 You want to get that um, butt cheek as high as you can off the mat. Squeeze. Good. You're halfway. If you need to break, if you need to break for a moment, go ahead. Come back when you're ready. We have 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Beauty. All right, please switch. Bye, birds. Do you want a drink of water? Help yourself. All right, so this time, right foot on the ground, kind of closer to your butt. Opposite leg is either up in the sky or place that heel on your right knee. We're gonna lift your bum up and your lower back up as high off the mat as you can. Lower, up and lower. And you're gonna be feeling this all through your right butt cheek and hamstring. Up, down, up, down. Squeeze, squeeze your bum, squeeze. We're halfway, we have 15 more. And again, if you wanna break for a moment, you can or keep going. jumping jacks. Come on, nice and strong. 15 more. your breath we're going into 10 weighted step ups so if you have a chair coffee table or bench now if you're just beginning 
You don't have to add weight. <laughs> the birds. Okay, so if you have a wall or a table or something that you can lean on for balance, step it up for 10 and down. Up and down. Now, if you're able, you can hold on to a pedal bell, dumbbells. You want to make sure your step is nice and high, not just like a stair. Maybe two stairs, three stairs. Let's do one more. Perfect. All right, I'm going to move my chair over here and I'm going into my left leg. So I'm going to step up and down. Up and down. Good. So as you get stronger and more comfortable, make sure you're adding your dumbbells and kettlebells to this to challenge yourself. Please give me two more. One more. Perfect. All right. Setting my chair to the side. 30 seconds cardio of your choice. This time I'm going to do Wow, we just heard peacocks, thunder, birds, dogs all at one time. All right, here we go for 30 seconds cardio of your choice. Did you hear all that? Welcome to Hawaii. Ten more. We're going out on a boat today later on, so I hope the thunder doesn't uh, impact anything. Five, four, three, two, one. The sky still is pretty blue, so. All right. Ten rocket launchers. So this is a wide stance. And we're going to come down. This time, instead of your plie, where you are sinking straight, this time, you're going to sit back like this. So we're going to pulse for three, two, one, jump. Three, two, one, jump. Peacock. Sometimes they know whether, well, they always know something weather-wise is going to happen before us, right? Birds, cats, dogs. Sometimes we don't feel the earthquake that happened, the earthquakes that happen, but the animals always know. And then they'll, they'll announce. All right, 30 seconds, cardio of your choice. Three, two, begin. What do I do? More rocket launchers. Keep going. Breathe. Come on. All the way down. One more. Perfect. Good. All right. Please come down to the mat. If you have your ankle weight, can you please put it on your right ankle? If you have a fit boot, please put it on your right foot. So we're laying on our side and we're going to start with leg lifts. So straight leg lifts. So these are really good for your gluteus medius. Hi birds. When we lived on the island of Oahu last year, there were so many peacocks, it was crazy. Here I've heard them, I haven't really, oh yeah, we saw them at the zoo, but that was it. 
I definitely hear them. Something different here is we see goats all the time. Just random stray goats. You'll be driving down the highway and there are plenty of goats. We did not see that on Oahu. All right, so now we're gonna take these two circles, forward circles. And you should be feeling this here through your glutes or your butt. Forward circles. Isn't that the prettiest sound? Five, four, keep going, three, two, and break. Good. All right, now we're going to do backwards circles, so almost like you're going to scoop it. Scoop it. the chickens. Ten, nine, eight, keep going, keep going, seven, six, five, four, nice and strong, three, two, good, and break for a moment. Now we're going into our forward circle, so we're going to take it around. Yes, yes, you can do it. Give me five, and four, and three, and two. Good, break again for a moment, and now we're going to take it backward circles. Ready? 15, 14, you can do anything for 15. 10, nine, stay strong, eight, seven, five, four, ow, three, two, and one. Good, take it off. <clears throat> and breathe. All right, guess what? You have just completed one full round of our butt, inner thighs, and hamstring workout. Feel free to go back to the top and repeat one more time. And then make sure to stretch. We'll see you back here next time in Hawaii. Great job.